Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 9 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about remove product from wishlist. First of all, uh, let's resolve one problem which is related to this search box. Whenever we search any product, uh, like let's search here and CD. Okay, and uh, now press enter. And you can see here, search text is not there in this search box. Okay, so let's see how can we resolve this problem. So switch to the project and go to the header search component class file. So just go inside the app directory, then HTTP live wire. And let's open this one header search component.php file. And inside this file, uh, let's create one property here. So right here, public and property name. Let's say property name is Q. All right. Now add here the lifecycle hook method, mount method. So right here, public function and function name mount. And inside this, uh, right here, dollar this arrow fill. And inside this, call your request arrow only and uh, single quote and just pass here this property name q okay send column now save this file now go to the header header search component view file so just go inside the resources directory then views live wire and let's open this one header header search component dot blade dot php file and inside this input text field uh, just add here value is equal to double curly bracket and dollar q okay now save this file now go to the browser and let's check so refresh the page all right now search any text here like eiu and you can see here the text is in in this search box okay all right now let's see how can we remove product from this list so go to the sub component class file first of all close this and let's open this one sub component class file and here uh, let's create a function for uh, removing the product from the wish list so after this just write here public function and function name remove from wish list okay and pass one uh, parameter here which is product id okay now pass here the row id not product id okay row id and now okay now inside this function i'll just add here for each and then cart colon colon instance instance and pass here the instance name of this list okay and then arrow contained edge dollar this uh, listed item okay so right here w item and now inside this forage first of all let's check here dollar this listed item w item arrow id is equal to uh, inside this function let's pass here product id okay product id and then compare with this product id okay so right here dollar product id if id matched then from 
cart instance this list okay then call here the remove method remove and then pass here the row id okay so w item arrow row id all right now let's copy this line and ref uh, this line is used for the refresh the component okay so let's copy and after this just paste here okay and uh, add here the return now let's copy this function name and save this file now go to the sub component view file uh, let's open this one and inside this storage This is the forage okay and uh, here is the this list icon okay add to this list uh, inside this uh, add to this list inside this if uh, if a statement just add here uh, first of all change here the text remove from this list okay and put here the hash sign and then Call here the method remove from this list. Okay, so write here wire call and click dot prevent is equal to function name remove from this list and then pass here the product ID. So write here double curly bracket then dollar product arrow ID. okay now save this file now it's done so let's check this so switch to the browser and refresh the page okay now first of all let's add some product to the guest list so add this uh, list icon is not showing okay this is the search page go to the soft page Okay, and you can see here the wish list icon. Now let's add some product to the wish list. So click on this icon and add it. You can see here the color has, has been changed, and you can see here one product in wish list. Okay, now add this, add this, and uh, after adding this product, this product you can see here uh, over icon is changed remove from this list okay so for removing a uh, product from this list just click once more on this icon and you can see here product from this list has been uh, product from uh, this list removed okay now just remove this one you can see here one product and if i click on this icon you can see here there is no any product in this list all right so in this way you can remove product from this list so that's all about remove product from this list so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching